Hi guys, I'm Greg Walsh. This is Tom Dillon. We're here at Wolf Brigade Gym in Rochester, New York. Now, we want to talk to you today about fixing your bodies, uh, both to prevent injury and enjoy your time on your bike a little bit more and hopefully for a little bit longer. Uh, something I've always wished I got cued into a little earlier was the idea of not just waiting for an injury to happen, but making sure my body was ready for it by moving correctly and keeping my body in the proper positions. Um, big things for us are working on your ankles, working on your low backs, working on your wrists, so that when you fall and when you hit the ground, you have less of a chance of getting hurt. So the tighter we are and the more restricted our range of motion is, the more susceptible we are to injury. One way we can start unwinding our calves and ankles is propping up on something like this. Tom's gonna to wind his foot up on this post, get his heel as close as he can to the post, and then lead in with his hip. Once he's got that position established, he can oscillate back and forth a little bit, find wherever it's tightest, and spend some time there. Spend three, four minutes each leg uh, to see some improvement in that position. Thanks to Kelly Sturette and his mobility project, um, we've learned that you can fix most of the issues your body is having, as long as it's not a serious injury, with a couple simple tools. These are just lacrosse balls you can get at any sporting goods store. Our recommendation would be to get three, tape two of them together and keep one single. What we've got Tom doing now is his feet are propped up on a box. He's gonna find the spot underneath him that's tight, and he's gonna brace up into a good position. So don't just lay passively on the ball. Tighten everything up, find the spot that hurts, and spend some time there until that spot seems to be making some progress and then move it somewhere else. This is a great way to prevent further injury when your back is already tight and hurt. With the double lacrosse balls, we can start that underneath your back with one on each side of your spine. Spend three, four, or five minutes down there until you make progress. We can also weight that if you're not seeing change with the unweighted version. You can also start anywhere from your neck down, spending adequate time loosening up the entire back. A simple fix for tight wrists that I had never thought of until I was shown is putting your hand on the ground flat, C-clamping your wrist, and then oscillating with a straight arm in all 360 degree range. Again, spend an adequate amount of time to make progress if you find one spot that hurts, that's probably the spot that needs it most, so hang out there for a while. If you've got flexibility issues, or you just simply can't put enough pressure on your arm with it on the ground, you can find a box or something else to do the exact same drill. Plant your hand flat, keep your arm straight, C-clamp with the other arm, and rotate in that 360 degrees, finding the worst spot and staying.